In lane number four, it's Sergeant First Class Elizabeth Marks, originally from Cottonwood, Arizona, already with a silver in the 53, bronze in the 50 fly. She's an active duty combat medic specialist in the U.S. Army as she gets ready for her final event. Women's 100 back in the S6 classification, the gold, silver, and bronze on the line. American Elizabeth Marks in lane four. Great start in both lanes three and four. Quick to the backstroke was Moreshko in five. We'll see that uh, very commonly with athletes with lower limb impairments as opposed to athletes with upper limb impairments that really use that underwater end. We see again Yuan Jiang toward the bottom of your screen. Out to an early lead, but we saw her fade. This right. stroke is really inefficient. Look at all the splashing and shrathing with her body. So she's not usually able to keep that up for the whole 100 meters. Turn's going to be key here. You'll see some of the athletes getting the tap, including Elizabeth Marks. She is actually the only one getting the tap, and she will get it right there to let her know it's time to flip, and she does very efficient, so clean. And here's where her efficiency and crisp stroke pay off. That turn was was incredible. She came in and hit the wall perfectly. Came in, flipped in pretty early, but was able to make up so much time there with the turn. It's in the middle of the pool and ahead of world record pace. Sergeant First Class Elizabeth Marks has the lead. Can she hold off the rest of the field? Just to her right is Shelby Newkirk of Canada going with her. You see Jiang in lane number seven. Can she maintain it? Right now it is Elizabeth Marks with just meters to go on her way to the gold medal. The tap will come out and let her know that she is indeed the gold medalist and world record holder. What a swim for Elizabeth Marks. She crushed that world record by two seconds. Marks often a little bit disoriented after she swims with some vision issues as well. That's why she uses the tapper, so she may not have even processed this result yet, but always showing great sportsmanship. Absolutely cool under fire. Elizabeth Marks puts on an, a show here on the final day. 119.57, and now she has the full set. The gold with the world record, silver in the 53, bronze in the 50 fly. And what a huge margin she broke that world record by. Almost two full seconds, including beating Song Ling Ling, the previous right. world record holder in this very heat. Great games as well for Verena Scott. She is really outdoing herself here. So pleased with that bronze medal. It feels like gold to her, but the gold will go to Elizabeth Marks in world record time. Well, it all started with a great reaction time for Marks in lane number four, and she gets it done with a beautiful turn as well. It's Elizabeth Marks just unbelievable performance. Look at that turn. Wow. That's where she won this race, Todd. That is where she won the race. She came in really nicely timed into the wall. I thought she might have been too far away, but once she extended that leg, she pushed off perfectly. One tap means one more stroke. She comes in and just a class act across the field. Marks congratulating everyone. Shelby Newkirk, who was with her close with us last 25 meters, ends up in fourth place. It is Marks that gets the gold. Jung of China gets the silver. And Verena Schott of Germany takes home the bronze medal in an exciting 100 backstroke in the S6 competition. Congratulations once again, Sergeant First Class Elizabeth Marks. Ladies and gentlemen, the national anthem of United States of America. 皆様、アメリカ合衆国国歌の演奏です。
Ladies and gentlemen, the Paralympic medalists. 皆様、パラリンピックメダリストです。